Howdy y'all, DJTJ here with Inkscape tutorial number 15, the erase tool. Alright, the erase tool can be found in your toolbox right here. The quick command to open that is shift plus E and it'll bring up a cursor that looks like this. If you click the first mode, it will just delete any object you put a line across. So I'm going to left click and hold and start drawing a line. It would delete any object that it touches. While we're talking about deleting objects, I just want to let you know that there's many ways to delete objects in Inkscape. You can take the selection tool and select an object. You can press delete. You can select an object and press backspace. You can left click hold and draw a bounding box around several objects and press delete or backspace and that will also get rid of them so you don't necessarily need the eraser tool to get rid of an object it just has some extra functionality if you click cut out from object now notice that there's a couple sliders here the first slider is just going to adjust the width of the line so if we up that it'll make it bigger super simple the mass makes the cursor drag slower so your cursor will still move but the line itself is just dragging a lot slower and it can be used if you're trying to do some really delicate or finite work um, I like to leave the mass setting a little bit low now finally is this last option to break apart cut items so if I go ahead and do something like that and then I go to select them they're still grouped together and you might not want that you might want everything to be broken up so shift E to bring the eraser tool back I'll go ahead and select this option I'll lower the width down a little bit and then I'll draw some lines through this now you can see that they're all individual objects and that does it for the eraser tool please watch our next tutorial Inkscape tutorial number 16 gradient Thanks for watching.